Greetings everyone, welcome to the Closet Reviewer channel. Today we are going to review the trench coat that we had ordered in one of my previous videos. And if you're curious to find out what was it about, just click on the window that appears on your screen. If you remember, I had added into the basket this nice jumper and I must admit that I am really in love with it. And it has these slits on the sleeves that I hadn't noticed when I was purchasing the jumper, but I really like it because it makes your accessories more visible. Today I'm going to try on these two trench coats that you can see behind me and I will need to make a decision which one to keep and which one is the best fit for me. Me. First, I would like to try the one that was the option number one for me, the one that had straps on the shoulders, the belts on the calves, and the one that was more oversized than the option number two. This trench coat seems to me like the perfect trench coat because it has everything that a classic trench coat has. The belt is slightly wider than I was expecting. To be honest, it gives a little bit of charm to this coat as well and a nice detail. This is how I would wear it in my uh, everyday life if the weather would be a little bit cold outside. I think what makes this trench coat nice is the style of it and it's hybrid so it can be worn with hoodies, with chunky shoes and it can be worn with office suits as well, especially if you wear a little bit of heel. And now let's go on and try the option number two. Comparing these two options, the option number one is wider than option number two. The colors are different, so the option number one is slightly darker than the option number two. This coat doesn't have the back bend as the option number one. I must admit that it is very difficult to decide which option to keep. Both of the trench coats have some uh, nice details in them. This one, it feels actually nice that you cannot see the buttons here. The belt is more of a natural width rather than the other one, but exactly the belt, the white belt, is what makes the other coat to stand out. In terms of colors, I must say that I prefer the color of the option number one and I like the back band in this coat. I think I will go with option number one. If you feel otherwise, just fill your comments under the video because it's very nice to hear someone else's opinion as well. Thank you everyone for your time and if you found this review interesting and useful, just put your thumbs up under the video and don't forget to subscribe to The Closet Reviewer so you don't miss out any of my next reviews and any of shopping journeys that we can do together. See you soon!